Red sky at night. Light of shorter wavelengths is being dissipated by water vapour and atmospheric dust. <laughs> Red sky in the morning, same. <laughs> Sitting at home, this guy knocks on my door. Have you ever considered an alternative energy supplier? I'm like, no, I'm quite happy with food. It's got to be a tough job going round door to door, encouraging people to photosynthesize. <laughs> I can give you the leading cause of anaphylactic shock in a nutshell. <laughs> <laughs> I went to see an acupuncturist. When I got home, my voodoo doll was dead. I read a book on Stockholm Syndrome, started badly, but by the end, I loved it. So that was... <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what really boils my piss. Hotel room kettles. If a man uses too much pornography, eventually it starts to affect his whole attitude towards slags. <laughs> One time I met a girl who confused a tube of KY jelly with superglue. Well, I asked how it happened, but sadly her lips were sealed. <laughs> I've been trying to persuade my girlfriend to sexually stimulate me with her key ring, but she just keeps fobbing me off. <laughs> <laughs> One time at a party, I chucked my car keys into a big bowl and everyone just stared at me and the trifle was ruined. Old lady names are very much back in fashion at the minute, like Lily or Elsie or Rose, and we wanted something like that for our daughter, but we couldn't decide. So in the end, we just called her Nan. <laughs> <laughs> I told her she'll grow into it. <laughs> <laughs>